Today, we're diving into an essential aspect of hydroponic gardening, water management. In hydroponics, plants thrive on nutrient-rich water. This hydroponic water, known as the nutrient solution, contains a blend of macronutrients like nitrogen, phosphorus, and potassium, secondary nutrients like calcium and magnesium, and micronutrients such as boron and iron. To ensure your plants receive the right nourishment, we use meters to monitor total dissolved solids, or electrical conductivity, and pH levels in the solution. These measurements help us maintain the perfect environment for our hydroponic crops. Now, let's explore some scenarios that signal when it's time to change the hydroponic water and why. Scenario 1. Imagine you have vibrant lattice seedlings growing rapidly. You've been diligent about topping off the water, checking the EC and pH and adding nutrients, but suddenly growth starts to slow down, even though EC is optimal. The answer to this is it could be a nutrient imbalance. Different plants uptake nutrients at varying rates. As your lettuce grows, it consumes nitrogen quickly, leaving other nutrients behind. Even if the EC is high, it might lack essential nitrogen. Time to change the water for a balanced nutrient solution. Scenario two, your hydroponic basil leaves develop purple spots and some leaves turn pale. Surprisingly, the EC and pH seem fine. Instead of deciphering complex nutrient imbalances, consider starting fresh. Dump out the water and prepare a new nutrient solution. It's quicker and more effective than troubleshooting nutrient issues. Scenario three, what if your hydroponic water appears less than pristine? Algae, floating bits, or even insects are present. Is it a cause for concern? Well, while clear water is ideal, sometimes appearances can be deceiving. If you've recently refreshed your nutrient solution, you might not want to waste it. However, contaminants like debris and insects can clog your system, making a water change necessary. You can address some issues like algae and insect larvae with remedies like mosquito dunks and hydrogen peroxide. But remember, visible problems indicate larger issues. In conclusion, while you can manage some issues in your hydroponic water, it's never a bad idea to change it regularly. Even if your plants seem healthy, consider changing the water at least once a month. Don't waste the old solution. You can use it to nourish your soil plants, house plants, or even your lawn. They'll thrive on it. If you like what you just saw, go ahead and click the link in the description to find a full detailed article on this video's topic. And if you learned something new today, hit that like button and let us know down in the comments below. Don't forget to subscribe for more hydroponics educational content and visit proponics.co.uk for in-depth articles on all things hydroponics. Grow smarter with proponics. And until next time, happy growing.